And today we're going to be looking at the sample osculator in Electrax Synthesizer by Tone 2. And this synthesizer is really crazy, especially the sample. So I loaded up a cello with a staccato arculation. I uh, can't talk today. But uh, it's, on, it's a staccato string sample from a cello. And I also got a piano sample in here as well. And... And this is what I got. And uh, I'm going to try to make it a little interesting. I got some cathedral reverb on it to give it a bit of space. So you could load in your sample in here and you could choose single mode or loop mode. You could start it at a different position. So you got your uh, you got your semitone, your key fold. You got a uh, just basic sample stuff, but uh, it's really nice to mix it with different synth sounds. It's really just fun. <laughs> And these samples are a bit just not really good quality. That's why it's kind of blah. Just thought I'd do a little demonstration. And uh, yeah, you can do all kinds of stuff. Even put some FM in there. That's all there is to the sample, really. You got, you got a lot of different things in the new version of Electrax, which is Electra 2. They give you a reverse. Uh, I think a lot of other features within the sample, the sample uh, OSC. But this is just, this is just like, you know, it, it's just easy deasy, you know, sample OSC in there with basic features, you know, and. You can add your filters to it, your uh, your effects and LFOs, and you can create some really crazy stuff. And and uh, don't be afraid to you know sample stuff in your DAWs library from like you know from different synthesizers and try it, or even making a sound on Electrax. I know people that resample a. a nice Reese and then they resample and they they put it in Electrax's uh osculators in sample mode and they just you know they they use an equalizer and equalize some of the parts out don't be afraid of doing that because you know there's endless possibilities with this this is Sebastian Weaver signing off uh please subscribe comment rate and uh see you in the next video